Hi, Professor Borengasser. This is the second part of my heart video. Um, I had a little trouble cutting and finding all of these, so I'll just do my best to try to point them out as much as I can. Um, so, let's see. The pectinate is in the inner wall of the right atrium, which is this side over here. Um, you can't... I have to open it. It's in there. Let's see. It's these ah, little muscles in here. Yeah. And um, for the right and left ventricle inside, the right would be. This is hard. The right would be on this side, and the left on the other side here. This hole is very deep, and um, the lighting is not that great. Um, okay, it says, why is the my myocardium of the left ventricle three times thicker than that of the right ventricle? And the reason of that is because the left side of the heart is bigger and stronger and must pump blood throughout the whole body. That's why it is much thicker than um, the right ventricle. Um, the trabeculae carne are, let me find it, are these little bumps and folds right here. Um, they're in both ventricles and on the inner surface of them. Um, let's see. The chordae tendinae, they're these. Okay. Here's a good one. These little string-like um, muscles that attach to the capillary muscles. Um, the pulmonary valve is inside the right ventricle. It's over here. Yes, this is the right side. Oh, I had it marked earlier. It's right here. And um, the aortic semilunar valve is in the left ventricle, which is this side over here. And, um, let's see, um, yeah, I believe that is all that I could find with this cut, um, so that's my heart dissection, um, talk to you next time.